Hello everyone, ladies and gentlemen, and as always, thank you guys for tuning in. Welcome back to another episode of 7 Days to Die. Today we are going to be doing our 14th day raid, okay, or horde. I guess you could say it's not really a raid. I mean, we are getting raided. Our base is getting raided, I guess. But we have a lot of stuff to do. We have a lot of work to do to prepare for the day 14. We only have one day to do it. The main thing that I want to get up and running would definitely be this turn right here. I really want to get this guy up and running. But this guy eats metal like crazy, okay? He quite literally will devour all of the metal that we have. Um, and that's pretty much what we're going to be working on today is getting a lot a lot a lot of metal to put inside of him um and that's really about it uh, i think i want oops i think i want to try and make some concrete as well uh, just to see if we could upgrade these as well just to get these a little bit higher level what do we need for this anyways we need yeah so we need cement basically we need we need small rocks for, to repair it uh but we need cement to actually i, I guess we could do this as well we need cement to actually upgrade it which i thought i had a submit mixer in my base for some reason turns out i don't um and we're definitely going to have to make ourselves a submit mixer which i don't even know how to make if it takes a lot of resources then it's yeah just not gonna have, i'm just not gonna deal with it let's see submit mixer so we need forge okay wow that's actually not bad at all yeah we could definitely do that i think we already have the resources to we do not we need more forged iron this has dude, that that has a lot of iron in it okay we can make ourselves like some forged iron let's just wipe this clean of forged iron oh we need a lot of clay yeah you see guys like we need to we need a lot of resources here we're even lacking on the clay department which usually you don't lack in the clay department usually you just have clay so while that's doing that i guess we could go out and start mining ourselves a bunch of metal up try to get like maybe two or three stacks turn into a bunch of ammo for that guy right over there so he can help us out during raid time and then we're going to upgrade all of the blocks that we have uh inside of our base let's put all this stuff away first and foremost our inventory is looking a little bit hectic just a little bit not a lot just a little bit put that away uh yeah we'll put the forged iron away definitely going to keep the motorcycle on us we we'll need that along with the gas for the motorcycle too we're gonna need that as well um and i guess we could take some antibiotics because we're infected of course and we'll keep the coffee on us yeah i got a lot of stuff in my inventory that i'm not even really not even using like that um i guess we could do something like that all right let's go ahead and go on this trip and uh mine ourselves a lot of iron All right, guys, I have returned to my humble abode. Um, I went up there mining for a few in-game hours, and I got myself two stacks of iron, which I believe... Let me let me just check. Uh, let's see, turret. So robotic turret ammo takes three iron. Okay. So if I'm using just one stack, it is, it's like 2,000 bullets, isn't it? I would not mind spinning a stack of iron on this at all. Um, I think we should actually. Where do I craft this? I can just craft it like that. Okay. So yeah, I get 2,000 ammo. And that's going to take 20 minutes. Wow. I'm hoping that's enough time before the horde happens. Uh, if not, I'd be very, very sad. Very, very, very sad. Let's get this started on some mass forward steel. Maybe not that much. Let's do like, uh, maybe like 50. I think about two minutes to do 50 of that. That way we can go ahead and start making the cement mixer and we can mix ourselves the cement. Which only thing we need is stone? Really? Is that it? I thought we would need something else other than stone. Wow, okay. I mean, shoot, okay, okay. I guess I'm fine with that. I got like oh we have cement. Hold up. Wait, does that mean we can upgrade them now? No, it doesn't. Huh. So, what do I need then? It's not cement. It's like cement, but it's in a bucket. I don't know what that is. What would that be? Uh, resources. Let's try. Let's try looking in here. Maybe we have to make it in here, or maybe we can only make it whatever we're trying to make. Maybe we can only make it inside of the cement mixer. I don't know. Or maybe it's called like mixed cement mix. 
concrete mix. There we go. That's what I was looking for. Concrete mix. So we need a lot of crushed sand. Hmm. How do we get crushed sand? So we already have 500. I'm thinking going to the desert. Is that crushed sand? Right there? What are you? It is! This gives me rocks and crushed sand. Okay, interesting. So it's just like the ground, I guess. Hmm. Does this give it to me? No, this just gives me clay. Okay, so I guess it's only in certain areas where it gives you the crust sand. So like right here, I can mine this out, right? And it'll give me the crust sand all the way through. Which is a little bit interesting. Hmm. I wonder if this is what I should do though. Or should I go to like the desert biome? Even though we don't know where a desert biome is. I mean like if it's crushed sand, I'm assuming if I go to the desert biome, I will get crushed sand. Because, I mean, it's, like, right there, right? Not sure, though. I wonder how much of this I'll need. At the same time, we're getting stone, which is good. You know what I mean? So, we're, like, killing two birds with one stone. You get it? Stone? Getting... I hope you guys get that. Okay. hope you guys... What was that noise? Alright. It's weird how there's no zombies around. You know, I haven't seen a single zombie since this episode has started okay that's kind of weird i mean i guess they're saving them all for day 14 horde i don't know but it is kind of weird i will say can i okay it is kind of weird i guess we'll just do this um i feel like this is probably like the most immediate like access we have trust sand it's just our front driveway i mean we can't really go anywhere else and that's gonna take a while to repair so I mean, how much do we have? 271 just from that. We got 1,800 cement. We got a little bit inside of our storage. Uh, and that might be enough just to upgrade, like, the outside stuff. What I really want to upgrade is this walk right here. Some of the pillars, like the main pillars in the front. And this entire thing right here. That's what I really want to upgrade. That's my main focus for upgrade-wise. For this, I just need metal, and I should make a metal hatchet. I should upgrade as well. I'm gonna work on that while we wait for this 60 minute. Yeah, it, that should definitely be done before uh, beforehand. And we should make the cement mixer as well. What do we need for this again? We need spring engine mechanical parts. Spring mechanical parts and engine. All right. There goes the mixer. Three minutes on the dot. Not too bad. Not too, let's turn that off. Not too bad. So the cement mixer is pretty much made. I can put all this stuff back in here. Save it for later. Get the cobblestone rocks out. And we need that metal. Okay, we got the iron. How do you make the metal hatchet? Because that's what I need to upgrade, right? So hatchet, iron hatchet, sorry. Oh, okay. Um, I think we have six. That's going to be on a timer too. <laughs> Everything is on a timer, man. At least we can upgrade uh, or at least repair the majority of this, right? Or am I tripping? There we go. Okay. Because this is important. This is what all the zombies hit. When they come up here, my sludge man can't hit them off like fast enough. This is exactly what the zombies go for. So it's really important that I keep this up. Because if something here down here breaks, man, it's, it's over with. Excuse me? I was just like stuck on a block or something. I think those are good. Also, someone in the comments gave me a suggestion to uh, dig this pit a little bit lower, which I already started here. I think I'm going to finish that as well. I, my, my main hope is that if I dig it deep enough, they're not actually going to be able to hit the pillars right here. Um, and that's just... Oh, that's a screamer. Can I take her out before she comes over here and screams? Nope. No, I cannot. I should have just done that in the first place. Me and my aim is horrible. Okay, well, so, um, hmm. I guess we'll just wait until all the zombies come over here because they're definitely coming over here. They're on their way right now. Everything here doesn't seem to be, like, 
too badly in shape. For the most part, I mean. It's not horrible. Hey, guys. I still on 13 minutes. What's this on? A minute and 10. I guess we can have a nice little warm-up mini horde. We've got 600 bullets so far. Let's test this out again, I guess. Be our second time testing it out. Where is it? Because this thing holds like 60 bullets, right? I actually wonder if I could like put it here and it'll shoot through the wall. Instead of like having it on the outside? Does that work? Oh, that's nice. He's missing a little bit. But I, I think I'd much rather have it like that. I mean, the benefit of having it here is that it'll shoot the zombies that are hitting the um, the pillars, which is good, right? Having it here, the zombies won't... I mean, the zombies won't get hit from him because the zombies are under him, right? So, I mean, that's a little bit of a benefit. But at the same time, having this guy just, like, straight in the front shooting them is, is actually kind of nice. I, I kind of like that. I don't know. I don't know. I might keep it here. I'm actually not sure. He's already out of bullets. So we got to keep reloading him like that. I guess we could keep it here just because it's easier to have him here and reload the bullets each and every time. Just like that. It's a lot easier. Versus having him out there. And then we have to go out here and, you know, do all that jazz and stuff. Yeah, I think we'll have that. I wish I would have upgraded my uh, my skills a little bit more because both of those turrets aren't active at the same time. The only way for me to do that is this one right here. Two deployed robots can be active at once. Level five, man. Intelligence level 10, like that's crazy. We're gonna have to level up so much for that. Hopefully we'll be at that level during the next raid. That's the goal. That is the goal. Might as well buy that, right? Uh, you are taking your products to the next level. Craft fair quality three robots. Still 20% more damage and 60% fast, faster fire rate. And reload extra 20 rounds. Robots active range is 15 meters. It's not too bad. So if I make a new raw wild right now. Robotic turret. It's level three. What if we made a, another different type of turret though? Like the SMG turret. I actually might make this. Or even the shotgun turret. Hmm. I don't think we'll have time during this raid. But a SMG turret or a shotgun turret might not be bad. I think I'd rather go shotgun. Because I want to use my SMG bullets, right? I'm assuming it's going to be using these bullets. So I think I'd rather just go shotgun and just use the shotgun shells. I think that's the better way to do it. To be honest. All right, cement mixer should be done. Nice. Where are we putting this? Hmm. I guess we could put it here. Move the bike out the way. Excuse me, Mr. Bike. Thank you. Uh, and just put it like here. I don't know if we're going to need more than these, though. That's the thing. Crushed sand. Oh, you can make crushed sand. You can make crushed sand with small stone. Wow. So the only thing you need to look out for is cement. And you can make cement, right? And cement is just stone. Yeah, cement is just stone. So it's just like a bunch of stone. Okay, awesome. So we can mix this. And then just make ourselves like a bunch of this uh, crushed sand. How much do you think we guys need? Maybe like... Um, we'll give you like 500. Yeah, we'll do like 500. I got 10 cement mix on me now. So how much cement mix does it take to upgrade one block? Let's see. 10. Okay. So it takes 10. And this has a durability of 5,000 versus 1,500. That'll help us a lot. That'll help us a lot. It is 1,700, bro. Oh, man. It's about to... Horror Knight's about to hit us. Horror Knight's about to hit us hard. We got a little bit of time left. That's on eight minutes. Mm -hmm. Maybe I should cancel it. Just maybe I should cancel and just go ahead and start doing that. Woo! All right. I hear you, Sky. I hear you. 
Yeah, but yeah, I think that's uh that might be the play here. That way we can get the just our upgrades out the way and we can repair our tools and stuff. I think we yeah, let's do that. We might already just have enough uh, ammunition for this. Yeah, we got one thousand. Yeah, we might be good. I'm hoping that we're good at least. Hoping that we're good. If we're doing that. We can upgrade these. That'll help us a lot. Um, put our stuff away. We also need to repair all of our tools. Um, we can put that up. Keep the cement on us because we want to make more cement mix. Throw that in there. Actually, no, no, no. We can just combine. Um, I think that's okay for the most part. Yeah, that should be okay for the most part. What do I need to repair this? Repair. Oh, nothing. All right, let's get the AK out because we love ourselves the AK. Get all of our ammo. You never know if we're going to need it. Get all of this ammo. Those are iron crossbow bolts, so we can't use those. Repair the AK. Repair the crossbow. We'll repair the spear just in case. We'll need it. I don't know. Okay, so we got a bunch of ammo. Probably definitely going to need it all. Let's, um... We already got water on us. Let's just top it off with some more water. We don't have a lot of food, so I'm just going to eat what we have. Just like that. Meds. I think we're good on meds for the most part. All right. We're just waiting on the cement now. 90 cement. That's pretty good for nine. We just need to upgrade the main defense. That's our main focus right now is just like... The main line of defense. Whatever it is that takes the most damage. Just like that. How much we got left? 21. Let's upgrade the pillars. Um, I don't I really don't know which ones to upgrade. The last raid, the last mini raid we did, these were in bad shape. So we'll upgrade these and then we'll upgrade the ones below us. I think that should be good. And if we have any, like, leftovers, then we'll, like, continue to upgrade, like, you know, everything that's pretty much cobblestone. We'll just continue to upgrade that. Upgrade this. Why not? Just for somatic purposes. 30 more. Yes, that looks good. That looks good. I like it. What are we at? 1900? We got three hours. Why do I have a broken bone? What? I sprained my leg from falling down there, I think. That is... That is crazy. At least I'll be inside all day now, I mean. Right? Can I... Can I use anything on this? I don't think I can. I just gotta wait until it's, uh, until it's better, sadly. That sucks. We won't be, uh... We won't be doing much running, though. So that's the good part. We'll just be staying inside all day. So there's that. Now I know to just not jump down here anymore. <laughs> like an idiot. I was a little stuck there. I was surprised they didn't they didn't throw zombies at us all day until like nighttime. Freaking screamer came out of nowhere. Even the screamer didn't bring in a lot of zombies though. She only brought in like like a few or something like that. Um Maybe we should upgrade the tops of those as well. And then sometimes the zombies hit those down there. So maybe we should upgrade those as well. Just to, you can never be too safe, right? I just know this isn't going to be making a lot of cement that fast. So I'm trying to like pick and choose what exactly. So like these, we can upgrade those. We need some more cement. But we'll upgrade those because I know those get hit. And then we'll upgrade those along with that. And maybe that. I think that'll be good though. Just need a little bit more. Just a little bit. That a great view. All 
Oh yeah, I forgot about the... Uh... Oh, we're good on this. Yeah, we only have four here, so we're good on that for sure. Get the side rails. Just in case. I don't know. Somatic purposes. Main line of defense right here. This is the part that matters. All right, I think that should be enough. I think, I hope. I'm sorry, Mr. Spring Leg. I'm sorry. I'm scared. There. And then this one. Um, I guess we could do turret too, because I don't want that to fall, right? So, do that as well. And then the stuff that's under it. There we go. Alright, I think that's good. I mean, for the most part. What else do we need for the upgrade? Aw, uh, dang. So it takes forge steel to upgrade it again. That's nuts. I don't think we're gonna need it to go that far. I think this will be fine for our purposes. Um, but just for like future reference, that's pretty nutty. That it takes that much. We were already struggling with our resources in the first place, and now we need it again to upgrade our walls. That's pretty crazy. All right, let's go back inside. Ooh, I'm a little bit nervous, but I think we got this. We got 300 bullets in the AK, 200 shotgun. We're definitely gonna be using a crossbow first. Um, just so, you know, crossbow, just because. I don't wanna waste all my ammo on the raid, right? If things get a little bit hairy, then bring out the pump shotgun. Honestly, I don't even think we're gonna need the AK. I think we'll be perfectly good with the pumpy, just because the pumpy is good, right? But I mean, if we need the AK, AK, if we got it, you know what I mean? We got it, we got it on us, which is good. All right, here they come. Here they come, they've come for me. Put all this stuff away. You got the turn put in work already. That's a good. They're not even running yet because it's not even a horror night technically. They're just here. They're just here to be here. <laughs> Maybe I should just wait and let my uh let my turn do everything. Reload him when necessary. We got about an hour left. That guy is stuck all the way over there. You guys Okay, I, th I thought I was close, but I wasn't close at all. Man, okay, that one was close. That one was close. Hello. Look at them. They're all coming, and it's not even 2200 yet. They're hitting something over there. I don't know why. It's not even 2200 yet. They're already, like, here. Already, bro. It's kind of crazy. I guess my turn doesn't reach all the way over there. Ah, how did I not hit that? What? Wow. Oh, I got this one. Okay, that's crazy. I don't know how I'm not hitting dude right now. I'm like almost there, but not there yet. Hey, there we go. There we go. There we go. There we go. He walked into it. Walked into that. I'm getting him now. I'm getting him. I completely missed him right there. Right in his leg. Oh, he's running at me now. Did he just shoot something at me? Where is he? Did he die? No way he died, right? I didn't kill him. Unless he did die. I guess he died. I don't know. I don't know what happened to him. I guess he died. He's just... I don't know. <laughs> I guess he died. Oh, we're thirsty. Let me make sure we're not thirsty when the raid starts. We've got like 20 minutes. All right, here we go. It's five minutes till. It's five minutes till. Look at the dark, red, bloody sky. It's about to go crazy. They gave us like a little bit of a sneak peek of what we what to expect like 30 minutes before before the horror is crazy. Uh oh, it's lagging. They're all spawning in. Oh. 
They're all spawning in. Where are they at? Oh! Dogs and everything. All right, let's do this. I'm gonna back up a little bit. It sucks that my uh, my my sledge isn't going off right now. But I wonder which one I should activate first. Oh, he's out of ammo. I guess that's good, right? As soon as he goes out of ammo, the sledge activates. Gives me a little bit of time to, uh, to turn back up. Boom. Turns up, sledge is back activated. That's kind of nice. I like that. That way the zombies don't, like, crawl up or anything. I like that. First loot bag. Nice. Come on, man. I want more. Give me more. How did I miss her? I wish there was a way to have these just like reload automatically. That'd be nice. Loot bag number two. That's all you got for me? I wonder what it takes to repair this dude, because he's like halfway right now. This is like my third reload, and he's halfway. I don't know what it takes to repair him. I'm not sure if I'll be able to repair him or not. If not, we still got Mr. Sledgy here, so it'll be fine. Blue bag number three, love to see it. Let's go turn. It's pretty cool that the turn also stuns them. Like they haven't even gotten a hit off on the on the front line defense. If it was just me up here. They would have been gotten hit off. There's so many of them. Oops. One more reload and dude is done. One more reload and dude is done, so bro. Loot bag number four, I think. Can I stay there? Can I get you? Can I? There we go. Ah, thank you. I think we uh, I think those are crossbow bolts, so we can't even use them. But thank you, I appreciate that. Loot bag. Done zone, bro? Yeah, he's done zone. How do I repair you? Oh, he's not done zone. He's not done zone. Not yet. Wait, I think he is. He's not shooting. How do I repair you? Just a repair kit? Okay, I think it's just a repair kit, right? Or not? I don't know how I repair you, to be honest. But you're repair now. Congratulations. Welcome back. I don't know what I use to repair you. Oh, snap. I didn't even 
knock you out. Shotgun. Actually, we're gonna use the AK. Shoot from afar a little bit. A shadow. I was like, wait a second. That looked that looks like the shape of a bird. I wonder why they're all coming from behind me. There's like no zombies coming from ahead of me. They're all coming from behind me. Kind of weird. Damn. I went flying. you turn buddy don't fail on me you can't i think that's all of it i think we're done yeah we're done d14 raid that wasn't too bad all right let's check out these loot bags oh i did not did not mean to do that all right Give me something good. Some steroids, okay. I like steroids. Some 762, nice. We use a lot of that. We use like 200 rounds or something. Shotgun ammo, some more food. More food and ammo. 762, 762, okay. That wasn't too bad. We got like, I guess near 100 ammo back, I think. Yeah. Yeah, that wasn't that wasn't bad at all. That was actually kind of good. That was actually good. I, I like that. That was lit. Well, our base definitely the, the turn situation we got going on needs help. Um, but other than that, I think we did really really good. Yeah, I think we did really really good. 
All right. Thank you guys for watching. I'm going to end the episode here, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.